Hi guys, welcome back to another redstone video. Today I want to show you a fast frosted ice highway maker. So we mostly want to use this in peaceful mode to travel to the outer end cities. We don't have access to a lot of gunpowder in peaceful mode, so that's why we thought we could maybe use the boats and ice. They can reach 40 blocks per second to quick travel around. So it is even faster than in lighter usually, 40 blocks per second. You can reach with a boat on frosted ice. All right, so this machine moves forward every six ticks or about 3.3 times per second. It's also a bit larger because yeah, a bit of more effort goes into making a faster flying machine. You need to get the piston update all right. All the pistons need to be zero ticked to be able to be moved quick again. And yeah, let's actually just check it out. I'll show you how to start it. So I just need to power the sticky piston here, depower it. That launches the machine. Then we got, then we got the frost walker armor stands that turn the water sources we generate into frosted ice. We got two in the front and two on the side to make guardrails so you wouldn't fall off with your boat into the void if you're not careful. So the way it works in the front we got sticky pistons pushing forward waterlocked blocks. It takes five ticks for water to spread. So just in a moment when a water source forms here in the back of the sticky piston, the frost walker one armor stand is pushed over and turns it into frosted ice. Yeah, the same happens here with the guardrails. We also push forward water locked stair there. And the water source just forms in the right moment. I also made sure that we don't get any water spillage. So there's always block around the water so nothing yeah, leaks out. I built this machine at around Y80, so it goes over the normal end terrain, but technically ends this could be in a way. So if you want to avoid that, if you want to build this machine even higher, maybe at Y200. Another option is also at the bottom of the world, then you can go under all the end cities. So if you build it as low as possible, then it also shouldn't collide. And then you could also AFK the machine, for example, yeah, just sit in one of those minecarts here in the back. Just enjoy the ride. So to stop the machine, I think one of the best ways is to quickly place two non-movable blocks. And this stops the machine. Technically, you could also maybe punch out one of those blocks here, but I think placing two non-movable blocks here is the easiest. Seems like we just lost the minecart there. To make it safe, you can also put, for example, walls around. Now there's really no way the minecart could fall off the back here. Alright, so let's try to stop it again. I'll show you one more time how to launch it. Just place a redstone block here. And it goes off again. Alright, I will provide a lab medic in the video description in case you want to build this. Thanks a lot for watching. See you next time. Bye bye.